So this is the Dori Flame, apparently the biggest uh, Indian buffet in the whole of North America. So we're gonna get some food. They have apparently over 115 dishes. So this is the first area. Let's see what they have here. Looks like it's some deep Dutch brownies and macaroons and some jelly, fruit custard, all of the good stuff. Which comes later, obviously. And then here we have some other stuff. This is the decor. So you have sevaya, gulab jamun, halwa. The ice creams are right here. The main course, butter chicken, goat curry, methi chicken, uh, lamb, it's called lalmas, I think it's from Jaipur, chicken biryani, looks so good. <laughs> then we have chana masala, aloo gobi, curry pakora, which is like a dahi yogurt based um, vegetable ball curry. Halal goat curry, chicken biryani, chicken tikka. And then right opposite you have the naan. That's why they make it in the big tandoori oven. All the spices. This is the tandoori chicken, malai tikka, murg, amritsari fish fry, chanpata alu. Some sambar fresh dosas with I think like they have a potato filling. So that's the masala dosa. This is papad, some fried green chilies for the extra spice. And then you have like the coconut chutney, tomato chutney, mint chutney, and all of that to go with your food. Ask for fresh chana batura. So that's the batura of India. So batura, that's the chana. And this is the if you need some more chili powder, pepper, or salt. This is the Pani Puri station and the Dai Chak station. That's where you get the Pani Puri. So you have the alu tiki, french fries. Make. What is this? Oh, veg springs, uh, spring balls or whatever. Papadi, namak pare. So it's the sweet and savory snacks. So what are you making? Golgappe. Golgappe. So first you put the, this uh, aloo thing, right? Yeah. Potato thing, okay. Then you put this white dahi yogurt thing, right? Now this is green chutney. So what chutney is this red one? Imli. Imli. Date. Tamarind. And dates, I think. Yeah. Cilantro. Thank you. Oh, and next to the fryums, they keep some chicken pizza or just the cheese pizza. So I stuffed these uh, puris with some. Um, 
uh, potato and chana. And I got some chutneys over it, some pani. If I want, I can just like dunk it in. Like this. And then eat it like a pani puri. And then sip maybe on the water. This is the fried fish. Amrit, sorry, fried fish. Chicken pakora. Tandoori. Uh, this is a Malai chicken pakora. Uh, this is the dahi wari and I have a paneer one right here which has like some yogurt on it. Okay. So this is the fish pakora. It's nice but I think um, I would like it more. Uh, with, I think there's like, a drawing that's missing. Also a little bit more spicy would have been better but the fish is really good. So this Malai chicken kebab is so yum. It's so juicy and good. And then I had this dahi thingy, the yogurt um, ball, it's not good. I didn't like it. So yeah, and then the chicken pakoda was all right. So this is the tandoori chicken, it's so good. It's juicy and really moist and they've done it really well. They haven't burnt it, which is exactly the way I like. So yeah, this is a definite must have. So this one here is butter chicken. This is butter chicken. Mm -hmm. This is the tikka, malai tikka. Okay. Uh, this is the goat curry. Goat curry. Mm -hmm. This is another goat curry, lal mas. Oh yeah, okay, lal mas. And mask. this is the methi murg. Ooh, so how is the butter chicken since you tried that? Really good. And what, what else did you try? Nothing else. Yeah. Try, no? Nothing else, yeah. Let's try this methi murg thing. Okay. How is it? Alright? Very unique. Unique? Okay, I'm gonna try it and then give us more adjectives. <laughs> okay, the verdict is butter chicken, mm, not so good. Definitely not authentic. Um, this uh, methi, the fenugreek uh, chicken, is pretty good. The, sh the start of the show is the red meat, the lamb, lal mask. This is really good. This is the Jaipuri one I was talking about before. Um, this lamb curry is again not that great and then this uh, malai tikka like with very little gravy is all right so there you have it and this is the biryani the chicken biryani so the biryani is not that bad i mean they could have added more spice but i guess it's like you know such a much scale that you can't really make it that spicy but it's all right i would definitely do the lal mask like a lot of it with like dosa not naan but dosa you know that right so these are the sweets we got to try there's a lot of ice creams also like i showed you guys but we just want to go with these and this is the badam halwa which, which i kept like my batura to go with like so it'll be like cheese and halwa and then what is this fish on the way so gulkan firni oh gulkan firni this is the kesa rasgulla Mm -hmm. That's the petha. Petha, okay. This is a different kind of gulab jamun. This is a different, oh, the coconut shavings yeah. on the gulab jamun. And this is the regular one, right? Yeah. Okay, let's try them. So, this is the badam halwa that I really, really love with the batura, of course. And this is the gokhan ferni, which my husband says is really nice, also, since he is not a fan of gokhan. And then the pita is really good. Like, I don't know if you can see the texture. And we've tried it like after ages. It's really good. And then this one is the bomb. It is so good, so yum. And then this is the go to. And then the gulab jamuns are obviously good. So, yeah. So, this gulab jamun is be definitely not better than this. This is way better. It's not a gulab jamun. What is that? Like? That's a case that's of rasgulla. Case of rasgulla. That's My why bad. it's so good. Okay. It's, you said it's not that good, no? This one. No, this one. is case of rasgulla. This is case of rasgulla. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. This is really good. Yeah. This is not that great. And then this melts in your mouth. These gulab jamun really do melt in your mouth. I just wanted to show you guys. Check the texture. It's so yeah. Okay, thanks for watching.